decided that this officer gets the dog, not you. Now at nine, breakups are hard and one community is making sure it doesn't happen this time. The decision tonight for a canine handler and his dog. That's our big story tonight. Keeping the team together, a Twin Lakes police officer is leaving the department, but he is not leaving his canine partner behind. It certainly took a lot of debate to get to this decision and a lot of cash. Fox 6's Angelica Sanchez is in Twin Lakes with why this went all the way to the village board. Angelica? Hey guys, K9 Rex's future was the only item on the agenda tonight. At times, this meeting got heated as everyone debated what was best for the dog. Dozens came out to show their support or opposition for former Twin Lakes police officer Joe Petla to purchase K9 officer Rex. It is my opinion if you don't honor a contract and you want a parting gift on top of it, or if you don't honor your country, it truly sickens me. The fate of the duo at the hands of the village board Monday night. The people that paid for the GoFundMe gave him what he wants, not you. This began when Petla gave the department his two weeks notice. He was told he could not purchase canine Rex. According to the police chief, there was a prior agreement during the canine's purchase that he would remain with them throughout his career. Those at the meeting debated what was best for the dog. If one subject matter expert that we spoke to had told us that Rex would in any way be harmed by retaining him in our community, I would have instantly fought for K-9 Rex to remain with Officer Patla. Members of the community already launched a petition which collected thousands of signatures to keep the two together. A GoFundMe was also launched to help with the purchase. We have decided that this officer gets the dog, not you. At the center of this conflict is the bond between a man and the dog he's clearly grown to love. Petla telling Fox 6 in a statement the canine was like a child to him. The board approved to sell the dog to Petla for $18,000. Now, Petla declined to do any interviews and instead said he would be issuing a statement at a later time. But in the past, he told us that his family was simply overwhelmed by the community's support. Live in Twin Lakes, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. No denying that bond between man and dog. Clearly shown there. All right, Angie, thank you.